spot today because I've randomly decided that I'm going to paint the kids bedrooms I'm going to do half a wall here for Isabella and half a wall for Harrison as well but I'm going to do Harrison's in a separate like bedroom transformation sort of thing on a bit of a budget as well I'm going to do Isabella's today because her stickers came so I'm going to be doing stickers and stuff like that yeah, it's really random I'm bored and I just thought I'm going to paint their wall so I've had a bit of a bit of a fear since I've moved in here to paint any of the walls so this will be interesting, but I'm hoping to do like a scalloped effect across the wall. So let's see, fingers crossed we get on all right and I'm just going to crack on and move everything into the middle and yeah, just go for it. Let's hope I don't get anything on the carpet. Okay, so call me mad, but I've decided to paint the kids' bedrooms. I'm going to do one wall and I've decided to go for blush pink. Um, and I've got these which are actually they look like just normal stickers but they're sprinkle stickers so as you can see I have done some testers this is the same colour and I don't really like it and I really don't really like that one at all it's like a really dirty sort of I don't know it, I don't like it so we've gone with another one which we haven't even tested on the wall yet and I've just looked online and it seems to be the right one so let's see if it actually looks alright when it's on the wall I'm somewhere in the middle Try to find myself again But life is one big riddle Of the future and what's been Cause it's the way it goes And I will never know Why you let me go Look to the left, look to the right Nothing can stop me in the night Like I am leaving all the bad stuff and trying to remain so strong I know it's good if I'm on I got it, I got it done all the prep so I put this frog tape obviously to stop it from going on the skirting boards and up this wall here because I'm not painting any other wall and obviously I'm going to go up this far so I've just done it there I've also taped, taped the dust sheet because one experience I've had and I've got a thicker dust sheet I used to get the really cheap ones and this one is actually really cool um because it, it's basically not that really like plastic baggy it's proper basically you could use this again it's short for like reusable rather than whatever so yeah, I've actually taped it to the skirting board because I do have carpet under here and I'm so scared. I'm normally the first person to get it everywhere. So yeah, I'm also going to try and find something to cover here. But if not, um, I'm sure I won't be too bad over here because as soon as I've got paint in my hand, I'm not finishing. Like I'm not going to stop. I'm just going to completely paint it. Um, obviously I'm going to need to do another coat, but I'm literally going to try not to move much so that I'm not really messy. Yeah, I'm going to try not to move that much. I'm going to take these glasses off as well. Don't worry, I'm not going to be wearing these glasses when I paint because they'll be covered, although I really need to because I need to be able to see. I put in contact lenses and I don't know if you can see, but one of my eyes is really bad because it broke in my eye and I've still got a little bit in there. It's actually quite dangerous. 
Um, so yeah, I've had to take the contact lenses out, so it's a bit annoying, so I can't actually see what I'm doing. <laughs> Unless I've got my glasses on. So yeah, I'm gonna crack on. Good, we're gonna paint that. I'm gonna make a cup of coffee first, because I just need a cup of coffee. I'm gonna paint that, and then see how it dries. It probably needs a second coat, and then I'm gonna put the stickers on, obviously, once it's all dry, which probably be, it might not be till tomorrow, because I've got to wait till it dries. I'm gonna open up these windows now as well. Um, to air it out um, and the kids are going to sleep in Harrison's room tonight so that there's 24 hours of no paint fumes and stuff and then they'll swap over and then I'll do Harrison's room which will be another video but yeah let me go and get a cup of coffee and then crack back on with painting okay so I've had my coffee and my dinner now because it's getting late now I need to probably put on my ring light in a minute because you might not be able to see me properly because it's such orange lighting in here but anyway I thought I'd say I didn't even explain so a minute ago you would have seen me going around with the bowl <laughs> so that's what I'm doing I'm doing it with the bowl it's like a bowl technique or whatever I looked it up so I actually found stickers first because I thought I'd judge up the kids rooms you know and I found these stickers like these sprinkly ones which I'm going to be putting on um, and I see the like this scalloped effect and I was like oh my goodness what is that how can I do it so I looked it up and they said you do it with bowls and measuring and all that I mean my measuring was ridiculous because I basically measured and um use this as a ruler so it could end up not really that straight it looks straight to me but you know it might not be so I'm going to quickly show you what the pencil if you can see the pencil marks because I basically have gone along with the bowl around like that and I just measured it in my own way because I'm very unique like that I'm very unique in the way that I measure you know when you see me put up a print in this room but yeah the room's looking an absolute shocker but I'm sure that'll be tidied up nicely when this is done I'm hoping to get the painting done like I said this evening and then depending on when it dries and stuff like that I mean it'll probably be tomorrow now I'll put on the stickers but yeah let's just crack on now in paint now and I look a wreck it is later on in the evening I think it's like half eight or something let's actually check what the time is it is quarter past eight still got the same picture of Harrison since he was born I've never changed it it's quarter past eight so it's quite late but I've let it dry I think it's dry now and I'm gonna now do a second coat and then hopefully well it'll, it'll dry overnight and then i'll do the stickers in the morning so let me just show you the progress i'm very very pleased with myself i'm not even gonna lie so this is how it's looking and honestly i am so happy with it i can't believe i've actually managed to do it amazing what you can do um so i don't know if you can see but like this is where no tinkerbell stay out there tinkerbell's trying to get in um i don't know if you can see because again this line's a bit rubbish but it's late at night Tinkerbell, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, it's an absolute mess in this room as well, look at this. Here is where I've obviously painted it with a brush and that's just because I was doing it as I was going sort of thing. This is all gonna, I'm now gonna go over this with a second coat 
and hopefully it all sort of matches and whatever's but yeah overall I'm very happy with that so far so I'm gonna crack on with a second coat now it's starting May anyway so I'm now going to leave that to dry I've put just on the second coat and I'm now going to leave it to dry and yeah I'm going to catch up in the morning basically and put all the stickers on so these are like the stickers I don't know if I've already showed you but I'll quickly show you now the stickers that I'm going to use and they're going to be like a sprinkle effect so hopefully it all goes well because I'm not sure because I like this but I liked it with the black dots like you know like a bit like that that looks lovely but it's better I wanted the sprinkles because it reminded her of summer so obviously it's her room she can have what she wants but if it didn't, doesn't turn out the way I want it to turn out then we'll be moving over to the black dots I think because that would look beautiful with a blush pink so I think you can see it's drying there nicely so we'll check up with it in the morning and see how it looks and hopefully that we don't need any more coats than that but now I'm going to go and get in the shower I'm going to clean up all of that I've got all of that to clean up and yeah, I'm just going to go and clean it all up and go and maybe jump in bed, probably. So good morning, it's now the next day and I'm going to quickly show you it dry and what it's looking like. I'm looking at it and I'm thinking, do I even put sprinkles on it because it looks so nice on its own? Like if you put some prints on that it would look really nice. So this is the wall, everything's looking lovely, it doesn't need any more coats than that. Let's try and put some sprinkles on and see how it looks after. Let me tell you this, let me tell you right now, your exquisite kiss still burning. Didn't know I missed this passion in life, now I'm addicted. So now let me tell you why, what is up with your smile? It's impossible, not melting, irresistible. When I look through your eyes, not even sky's the limit. I used to be satisfied. Taking off the tape. I hope it's a straight line. How satisfying is that? So here is the wall. I'm so happy with it. Honestly, it's come out so much better than I even thought. And yeah, I've just literally, everything else she sort of had already, like the dusky pink stuff. 
but this wall has made the most amount of difference i mean look at that to be fair one wall and it just makes it so much better i've also put this light fitting in here because we didn't have one and um, i've actually nicked this from my um my bedroom for now because i wanted to get a brighter one but she really wants this light so we'll see if i'll get a brighter one for her and then change that back or get a different one for mine but yeah so i've put that up now so it's so much better even just with a light but yeah look how beautiful is that looking Knowing there is more in life that I 